I was trying to show my shoes because they were really cute. Why is it not focusing? Okay, there we go. Um, I was trying to show my shoes because they're super cute. They're my Sperry's. I love them. I've had them since like legitimately seventh grade, uh, but my feet haven't grown, so they still fit. Yay. Something interesting is happening today. Um, I am actually, I have an appointment in a few hours to get my Sully brace. And most of you guys are probably like, what the heck is that? Um, oh my gosh. For, okay, I should give you some backstory too. So for those of you guys who don't know, I have something called Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome, which is a connective tissue disorder. So connective tissue is supposed to be the strong glue that holds your body together. And for people with EDS, ours is incredibly fragile and weak and my body literally falls apart down the road. Oh my gosh, I need to stop doing that. Um, so anyways, it causes a bunch of issues in my body. So that's why I have my port and my feeding tube and stuff. One of the biggest issues that it causes in your body um, are joint problems, specifically joint dislocations. So like I said, connective tissue is supposed to be strong and hold yourself together. It's the glue in your body. For people with EDS, ours is really loose. And so we have a lot of joint pain. Um, we're super, super flexible, like contortionist level flexible for a lot of us, including myself. Um, and while that seems super cool and fun to be like a human Gumby, um, it also means that I dislocate over 30 joints every single day and that is not so fun. So one of my worst joints is my left shoulder and you guys can't see it right now, I'll show you, but it is permanently dislocated. It's been dislocated for like two years and we've done a lot of things to try to fix it and it just doesn't work. Like here, I'll show you guys. This is how my shoulder sits all of the time and it might look normal, but I'll show you guys. I will put it back into place. There you go. And as soon as I let go, it falls out again. And I'll actually show you guys what that looks like on an x-ray. This is an actual x-ray of my shoulder um, right here. So as you can see, very badly dislocated shoulder. Um, and it looks normal when like through a shirt, but it stays like that all of the time. And yes, it's painful. All of my dislocations hurt. That's another question that I get a lot is, does it hurt to dislocate joints since it happens so often? Yes, it does. It still does hurt, um, unfortunately. But anyways, so it's getting harder and harder to use my shoulder and the only thing that can truly fix my shoulder is surgery, but even that has a really high rate of failure in people with EDS because our, our tissues are so loose that if they do the standard tightening surgery where they go in and tighten up all of your muscles and ligaments um, and force your shoulder in place, the problem with that is one, a lot of surgeons won't even do it anymore because it's very likely to fail that your tissues will just stretch back out again and not only are you right back where you started but then you have scar tissue and all this excess stuff from surgery so that's not really a good option and i've chosen not to do that um, i have however met with a surgeon in the past here in minnesota who is doing a new type of experimental surgery that has much higher success rates um, but unfortunately it is a really major surgery I talked about that because I'm sure in the comments I'm gonna get a lot of like why don't you just have surgery to fix your shoulder or, like can't they do surgery um, and the answer is they can but it is risky invasive and just something that I'm not personally ready to do yet um, if it got to the point where I really couldn't use my arm at all that's when I would consider it but I do not want to jump to something that could end up just making me worse off if I still am able to use my arm you know um, so Back to the Sully Brace, that's what this video is about. Um, I am getting my Sully Brace today, and that, the surgeon who actually talked to me about the donated tendons is actually the one who recommended this brace to me, um, and that was like a year and a half ago, and I just forgot about it, things, I had more important things going on, like starving to death, uh, and you know, we were dealing with feeding tube stuff, and just things got in the way and it never really happened but i'm at the point where i really am like let's do this like I, I need to try this a reminder to myself to film this video i don't know if you can see that but um 
I decided it was time to get the brace, um, so I had my orthopedic doctor order it. I have to go in and be fitted for it, so that's what I'm doing today, and the hope is that this, I, I don't even know how to describe the brace, so I'll just let you guys see it in a minute. These braces are sp specifically designed to keep shoulders in socket, like they're for people who have dislocated their shoulder and need to rest it, or people who have really unstable shoulders like myself, or for people who have permanently dislocated shoulders like myself. I'm really, really hopeful that this will help keep my shoulder in place, in socket, and um, allow me to use my arm more comfortably, and hopefully stop it from getting any looser than it already is. So, all right, I'm gonna go get fitted for my brace. I'll see you soon. I think it needs to be a little bit, the position of this shifted just a little bit, but other than that, like, more kind of directly upwards, but... Okay. Otherwise, it works. Just I'm shocked. <laughs> I was hopeful, but I'm shocked. <laughs> That's it. Feels good. I feel like this setup is has become my new normal video ending, is me sitting in bed saying, hi, it's the next day. I forgot to film, or I was too tired to film. I didn't forget to film, I just purposefully did it last night. I, the last thing that you guys saw was me at my appointment, um, wheeling down the hallway and trying out my brace. So, okay, <laughs> I think I haven't edited yet, so I'm not sure what that video looks like, but I'm pretty sure I cut out most of the talking in the actual fitting, so let me just bring you up to speed. Pretty much, we ended up using the brace a little differently than it was intended to be used. <laughs> uh, my brain fog is so bad right now, sorry guys. Um, but we use the brace a little bit differently than it's intended to be used. So like the straps are in different places and, but pretty much we just said, like we just took, I put it on, <laughs> just, wow. Um, I put the brace on and then we just put the straps in areas that I needed support. So like my shoulder sits forwards. So we used a strap to pull it backwards and then we used a strap to pull it up and we actually got it to sit in a really good position. and. For the most part stay there i mean it's not 100 percent perfect but it is 
so much better. I'm not wearing it right now because I just took it off. I was wearing it for like five hours this morning and I just took it off to give my arm a break. So I'm just wearing it for as long as it's comfortable and if I feel any discomfort, then I just take it off and give myself a couple hours of break. And so yesterday I wore it for a couple hours and then took it off for like two hours before I went to bed. And then this morning, as soon as I woke up, I put it on and I wore it for like five hours and now I'm gonna give myself the afternoon off. Um, but I, I honestly love it so much. It's genuinely helpful and it's the first thing I've ever had. It sounds like I'm gonna cry, but it's really just my allergies. Um, anyways, it's the most help that I've gotten from anything ever with my shoulder. Like, I'm a doctor told me that my my most recent doctor's appointment, my doctor was like, I think it's a reasonable option to consider surgery. And I was like, um, I don't really think we're there yet. So I wanted to try this brace first and see if it helped. And I actually, like, I was so pleasantly surprised. The only discomfort that I've had, the only discomfort that I've had so far is, I am really starting to have an issue, guys. Hold on. And I've seen a lot of benefits, so <clears throat> I'm really enjoying the brace and I will keep you guys updated with my progress. Anyways, so subscribe if you haven't already. Join the Stripes family and I will see you guys next time. Bye!